Volunteers with Sanford Children's Hospital completed the first phase of a landscaping project in front of their building today. As Kelloland's Perry Groton reports, an insect is the inspiration behind this artistic work in progress. Stone by stone, a caterpillar-shaped canvas snakes through the playground outside the Sanford Children's Hospital. We tried to find volunteer things to do and this seemed like a good idea. Volunteers with the hospital's IT department hand-painted dozens of rocks to be laid side by side. The head that I painted came out of my own personal rock garden because we needed a, a bigger rock for, for the head. The rocks are painted with acrylic markers. And then we spray it with a high gloss so it'll stand up to all the weather. The caterpillar's name is, of all things, Perry. But much to my dismay, I found out that it's not named after me. Now instead, this Perry has a much more significant meaning behind it. We came up with the name Perry um, from the word perseverance. We feel like all the families, the patients, the nurses, the doctors, all the staff, um, everyone included in the castle and children's journey, that perseverance is a really big thing that we learn from all of them. The volunteers hope patients will paint their own rocks to be added onto the caterpillar. What other animal or insect do you add a lot of rocks to? Well, this is one of them. Perry has the potential to stretch throughout the entire playground, an artistic celebration of perseverance proudly displayed in the Sanford Castle's Caterpillar. I think that's what's been a lot of fun about this project is that one simple act has turned into something so much bigger. In Sioux Falls, Perry Groton, Kelloland News. Perry, the caterpillar, not the reporter, joins the much bigger caterpillar named Henry on display at Sanford Children's Billion Pavilion, which opened this spring.